What up, what up, what up? Two Raw for TV. Want to give a special shout out to the trolls, my side bitches. Also, want to give a shout out to the subs. The channel is growing. And this one right here, we're going to talk about the evolution of Chicago hip hop. And how a lot of Chicago artists are getting a chance to break mainstream and come into the music game. Two Raw for TV. Now check this out, y'all. I feel like Chicago is one of the most authentic places a rapper can possibly come from. And as y'all can look on your local TV news, the murder rate would be indicative of that. Also, I feel like Chicago is not a place to be a studio rapper or a studio gangster because you will get exposed real quick too off of TV. I'm a native Chicagoan, so I know firsthand. It's real game bankers out here, and it's real life drama. So if you're rapping and not really living your raps, your, your, your coattail will be poor real quick. Too raw for TV. Now, Chief Keith will get most of the credit for putting Chicago on the hip hop map uh, as of late. But little do y'all know, Chicago has always been on the map with all these rappers that's coming up in the game. Chief Keith, Lil Bibby, Lil Herb, now G Herbo, and all these guys. But what I really want to touch on with this video is how negativity and crime and drama and killing, murder, that is popular in today's society. That is what people crave for. That is what people want to hear about. That is what people want to see. That's what makes people think they cool in our society now. So it's like, even, even, even a guy like Drake. Drake got a guy by the name of 600 Breezy, who's a game banger from Chicago. And Drake is drawn to this guy's lifestyle and the type of environment he comes from. So this guy is basically been put on by Drake because Drake was just influenced by the Chirac uh, 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 style, if that's what you want to say. With the new song Drake got out now, Look Alive. You cannot tell me that that wasn't a Chicago influence song as far as the lyrics. That man wrote that song for Drake or he helped Drake put that song together. If you know the lingo, what Chicago people say, you know what I'm talking about. The part when he say, I got racks to go outside and I spit it with the guys. That's Chicago lingo. That's what we say. We always talk about our guys. Too raw for TV. It's like we so backwards in today's society with our youth. It's like the game bankers and the drug dealers get all the credit and they get all the glory. And that's who a lot of our youth inspire to be like. They don't want to go to school to be a doctor or a lawyer or to, 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 to be a brain surgeon or something like that. That's not what they want to do. They want to be like Chief Keith. They want to be a gang banger or a gang member on Folks Them, on Folks Them Grave. That's what they aspire to be. So to me, that's why Chicago has blown up because of the, the violence that it's known for and the people that represent that to other people around the country and around the world, they think that's cool. As crazy as that sounds, that's the truth. Too raw for TV. So y'all tell me what y'all think about this shit. Subscribe to the channel. Leave your comments down below. Peace.